Well guys, time for another unboxing and another very expensive one once again, yes. Well, after giving a lot of thought, I said, you know what, especially now that I have Interstellar um, Blu-ray in my collection, my 32-inch TV really needs to go for watching movies. I'm still going to keep it. I plan to use my 32-inch as my desktop uh, um, monitor. Also, I'm going to have it as my secondary gaming monitor as well. So... Um, but I decided for watching movies, I have to have something bigger. So I picked up this Vizio 48 inch uh, full 1080p LED smart TV. Uh, this is my first time ever buying a Vizio brand. Uh, but I have a, few, a lot of friends that have Vizio TVs. I've looked at reviews on Vizio TVs, and so far it seems like it's a good brand. So, um, yeah. So, so it is a smart TV, it's 48 inch. Uh, they wanted like an extra like $150 for like a 50 inch TV. It's ridiculous. I don't know. But I actually got this on sale for I think $480. Not too bad. Not too bad. So I mean I'm pretty sure back when I bought my 32 inch three years ago, I'm pretty sure a 48 inch probably was going for like seven to 800 then. I know 4K is coming out, but it's I'm not really going to jump the gun on 4K right away. I'm probably going to wait another 10 years before I jump into 4K. And by then, if I want to get a 4K TV, uh, in order to enjoy 4K to its fullest resolution, um, i probably going to get like an 80 inch or bigger when that comes around. But until then, uh, this will definitely keep me very, very happy. Now the fun and tricky part, doing the unboxing. Uh, I couldn't find, I don't know what, where the hell I put them, but I couldn't find either one of my camcorders. I couldn't find my Samsung or my Insignia. And I have no idea where they are, so... Sadly, because uh, I haven't touched them in over a year now, so I, I put them in the, the original boxes and I put them into storage, but I can't find them, So, because uh, I just use my phone to film everything. So I guess for this video, I'll have to use my phone as well, so I'm going to be limited on what I can show you, uh, just because uh, for this size of a TV, I'm going to have to use both my hands at some point to pick it up. So, uh, But we'll go as far as we can on camera. So... Sadly, I need to get, I gotta see if there's like a mount you can get for a tripod for your phone. Because if I get one of those, then that would solve everything. So, yeah. Alright. Let's open it up. Ah. Looks like, is there some assembly required? Yes, there is. Okay. Interesting. Alright, I thought for a TV this side, well, I guess because the stands are pretty wide. Um... Because it's not a usual mount TV. It's they actually have like little pedestals, as you can see. So it looks like they probably just snap on the bottom, maybe a screw or something. But uh, I'm gonna have to put the camera down, take the TV out, and uh, in fact, let's see what I can do here. It's still taped. Oh. There we go. So it's Tuesday, August twenty-first. Today's actually my day off, which is nice. First Tuesday I've had off in probably like over a month or two now. Actually, no. Last time I had Tuesday off, I think, was back in January. So, that's, uh, oh, there's the remote. Oh, nice looking remote, too. Cool. I heard it. the plastic on there, it's hard to see. But here's the two mounts for the TV. So there's a power cord. And some screws, because I have to get a screwdriver, but that's fine. And there she is, the TV. Alright, I'm going to put the camera down. Sorry. Um, is there a way I can mount this? I don't know. Um, let's see if I can find something to mount this on real quick. There's got to be something like a book or something lying around here somewhere. Ay, 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 ay. Uh, I guess I'll just put you down. Sorry. Alright, now let's one start getting out of the two box. Uh,
Okay. Here's what it looks like. Uh, I can't turn off my light. Sorry. It's one of the things that sucks about with my... Uh, unlike... I, this is why I kind of wish... I need to get a new camcorder. But that'll be later on. Because I want to get a PS4 and stuff this year, too. But uh, eventually, uh, this is one thing that sucks about my phone is you can't turn off the light while you're recording. You have to turn off the recording and then start up again. I don't feel like doing that. But here's what the TV looks like. Very nice. So, yeah. Well, I'm going to go mount it and then put it upstairs in my room. And then I'll do a whole separate video on what it contains and stuff like that, how the picture quality is. I mean, I looked it up. It does do 1080p. Uh, I think it's 120 hertz refresh rate, something like that. And, uh, yeah, LED, smart TV, looking forward to checking it out. So, alrighty, guys, when I do my full review, I will post it on YouTube. All right? Thanks for watching, guys. See ya.